Hey, my water sign friends. This is for Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Um, there's not really a date to it. If the energy flows with you, if it resonates, um, stay tuned. If it doesn't, then check out your moon rising or Venus sign. Um, this is for sun, moon, rising, and Venus water. So I'm going to go ahead and tip you on down here. And Spirit Angels, what messages do you have for our water signs? Okay. So um, for some of you water signs, there's something that you can't seem to shake. There's something that you can't get off your mind. Um, you're worried about something. You're worried about something financially, um, something that has to do with your stability, your home life, um, how you're going to provide. Uh for your family. Yeah, you're losing a lot of sleep over this. Um, some of you have a decision to make that will affect your um, stability. Yeah, that card just popped out. The Two of Swords. So you guys have a choice you're, you're coming up against. Um, you have to make a decision on what to do. And... Um, it's going to affect your finances and you're really stressing out. Um, your overall energy is the five of cups. So yeah, you're um, experiencing a lot of, or in the past, you've experienced a lot of heartache. You're just emotionally drained, but you are coming out of that, um, that energy, but your main, uh, main, Thing here is there's a choice. Um, you're not looking at all the facts though. You're not looking at everything from a um, non-biased view is what I'm hearing. Okay, so the person that you are dealing with um, in the past, they refused to, to move forward. There was no success where they were at, but they didn't move forward either. Currently, there is, you could be dealing with a Taurus with the earth sign and the Empress, but there's no, there's no new beginning here. There's no creation of a relationship. There's no creation of moving, of anything new. Yeah, for some of you, the person that you are dealing with, this earth sign, they're very out of um, their element. They're not balanced. They are going to, however, start putting the work in. They've been very patient with you making a decision as well. For some of you, you have been with this person in the past. You separated from this person, even though it was very hard to do water science. Um, and this person refused to move on from you. They refused to give up on this connection. Um, even though you could have been cold, standoffish, not nurturing to the relationship, they knew that there was something here. They knew that there was um, something to be created between the two of you. And they're patiently waiting for you to make your decision. Um, they're patiently waiting for you to decide which direction you're going in. And when you get out of this um, depression or the sad state of what you've lost in the past and realize that you still have all these blessings around you, they're going to be here waiting for you, waiting to give you a new beginning. Um, this is definitely an earth sign uh, energy that I am feeling. In the past, you didn't choose this earth sign. You didn't choose this Taurus, um, possibly. But... Um, it really tore you up. You didn't know what to choose. But you decided to move forward without this, with this earth sign. Now you're faced once again with a choice. They've been very patient with you, though. What is the outcome of this connection for our water signs? Oh, beautiful. Okay. 
So your bottom of the deck is judgment. Somebody else got judgment. Fire signs did um, for their bottom of the deck. And the Wheel of Fortune is your next card. And the Magician. Wow. So um, with the bottom of your deck being judgment, you do have somebody coming back or you are returning to somebody, Water Science. And that is your choice. That is your decision. You guys, um, I do see this relationship coming back together with new beginnings. Um, this is a soulmate relationship with the King and the Queen of Pentacles here. Um, this is a soulmate connection. Then when you have the Ace of Pentacles, the gift from the universe, and temperance here as well, this very well could be also a twin flame relationship. But um, they left very fast in the past, or you did. Um, they were in and out. The connection was very, um, very hit and miss. You guys have been going through a spiritual rebirth, though. The Five of Pentacles in reverse to me is... Yeah, coming in out of the cold, but it's a spiritual rebirth. It is finding your spiritual center and um, and embarking on that journey. In the future, you guys find balance. Um, you find peace. You find healing. You find success. You find emotional contentment, um, emotional abundance. Yeah, and when I have, most definitely, when I have the king and queen of a suit, it is, to me, a sign of uh, soulmates. Yeah. But there's a, there's got to be healing in the future, though. Um, right now, you guys are going... Right now, water signs, you are definitely going through a spiritual rebirth. You can't start something new yet because um, you're currently being awakened. You are going to find peace and balance and healing, though. And you are going to find stability within each other. You're going to find happiness, abundance. What advice do you have for our water signs? Okay, that is way too many. Okay. It's safe for you to love. So the angels here are Telling you to open your heart, to give, um, to give and allow uh, love to come in. You know, allow this energy to um, to heal you. Allow this energy to help you make a choice. It's safe. You are debating whether to trust this person again or whether to move on. And spirit is saying it is safe for you to love them. Allow their love to come in. They've been very patient with you while you heal. While you find balance, while you find yourself, while you find your spiritual center, while you find success within your own healing, they've been patiently waiting. And while once you come out of this um, sadness, this depression and realize the blessings you have that are all around you, they're going to be right there to offer you this new beginning, to offer you this success, this abundance, this happiness. And spirit's just wanting you to know it's safe. It's safe for you to open up. It's safe for you to give and receive to this highest energy of all because this is spiritually guided. This is sent here from the universe with the temperance card um, and the ace of pentacles. So don't uh, don't let the stress and the sadness um, overtake what you want. Go for what you want. Um, set your goals. Set your um, sights on something and go for it because it'll all be here waiting for you when you're ready. So... That's all I have for you, water signs. I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful week. And um, and don't forget to uh, make that gratitude list. Don't forget to do your positive affirmations because it's safe for you to love and they're waiting for you. So heal and, um, and find that spiritual center that you are looking for and all your abundant gifts are going to come to you. As always, I send you love, light, and God bless.